In this video, I'm going to show you how you can integrate Stripe with your Lovable Build app. I have this demo site here called React SEO, and I've been progressively adding features and showing you guys how to build something like this yourself. So if we scroll down a bit, we can see we have our pricing table here. What's going to happen is when a user clicks get started, they'll be redirected to Stripe, take the payment, and their account will be activated to whatever product or service that you're selling. All right, if you don't have one already, grab yourself a Stripe account, head to stripe.com and sign up and go to the dashboard. And you should get to a dashboard that looks something like this. The next thing we want to do is go to product catalog and you can see I've already created a product here called React SEO. If you want to create a new product and we have to do this to actually complete the process with Lovable, go to create a product, click on here, we'll put in the name of it and I'll just put test for now. You add in your description. You can upload an image of your product or your service. Now, this one here, you need to choose whether it's going to be a subscription model or a one-off payment. I'll keep it for a subscription. For the amount, choose your currency. I'll go for US dollars, put in $100, and then you, you pick the cycle. So that'll be $100 per month. Add the product. I won't add it because I've already got one. So that's pretty much how you can create a product. Now, you can have multiple prices for a particular product. So if I click in here, you can see I've got four prices for this product. We can have a monthly price, a yearly price, and you might have a price that's for a discounted period or a promotion, that kind of thing. So once we have our product and prices, if we click on, say, this $29 a month one, we can see up the top here, we get this price ID. I'm pretty sure Lovable is going to ask for that price ID once we start doing the integration. If we go back over to the to the home tab here, the other thing that Lovable will probably need is these API keys. We have a publishable key, which is anyone can see it. It's no big deal. And we also have this secret key, which we don't want to share. So with all that done, now we can go back over into Lovable and kick off this integration. So back over in Lovable, I've got this prompt here. You can copy it if you like. So can you set up integration with Stripe? I have a price ID, a publishable key, and a secret key. Use Superbase Edge function. And also this app is published via Netlify to the following URL. And that's important because it needs to know where to call back Stripe after it processes the payment. Like where is it going to land to? What page it's going to show? So just be aware of that. Now I'm going to hit go on this and see what happens. Okay, so the first thing it's going to do, it's going to ask you to enter in your Stripe restricted API key. This will be the secret key. To get our secret key, head back over to Stripe. Down the bottom here, you'll see developers in the bottom left. Just click on that. Then you'll see API keys. Click on that. Once you're in here, you'll see this create a restricted key. So we're going to click on this. And then it asks how you're going to use the API key. I'm just going to say I'm providing this key to another website. Continue. Now, for the third-party website and the details I just entered in, Lovable, hit submit. You're going to get asked a few security questions, and then it's going to give you that secret key. Take a copy of it, paste it in, enable Stripe, and press submit. Whatever you do, don't enter it in down here. Enter it in the special secret box up here where it's masked and hidden, and then we just hit submit. Okay, now it says, great, I need a few details to get your Stripe integration set up properly. Payment type, we want reoccurring, your Stripe publishable key, so I can provide that, and your price ID. To get your publishable key, just go back to Stripe, click on home, and click this one, click to copy, and the other one is the price ID, so go to our product catalog, click in here, we're going to add this one here, and just click on the price ID and copy that. So I've entered in those details down in the prompt and I've also said update the $8.99 to be $29 a month and we will update the other prices in the pricing table which is shown here. We'll do them a bit later. So the idea is to get this one working at $29 a month. The other thing you'll note here, it says it's going to create a Superbase Edge function and it'll update the pricing component to, to handle it. So let's hit go on this and see if it can complete it. All right, why Lovable is building that if you would like to get your hands on this WordPress style CMS PRD and get Lovable to build it no code without doing anything, just head over to Ambitious AI Community, go to the classroom and then click on SEO resources. Scroll down to here where you see PRD, just copy this PRD in full, 
paste it into Lovable, and you will have your own WordPress style CMS built for you, SEO optimized, and you can integrate it with Stripe, and it's all done for you. First link in the description, grab it totally free. Alrighty, so that process did run. It did hit an error, and I just pressed fix it and it seemed to fix it i also got it to check that in order to subscribe the user needs to be authenticated so what happens is if you try to subscribe and you're not authenticated you, you have to authenticate and then you can subscribe and the reason for that is you need to pass the user details over to stripe to create the subscription so that's all in place it pretty much did it in sort of two two separate runs within lovable and i also checked that it's updated the database so that it can manage the subscription status so now because this is hosted on netlify once these changes are made it flows through netlify to be published so if i go back to the react seo.dev site and i refresh it if i scroll down to the tables we should see one for 29 dollars now i'm already logged in so if i hit subscribe i should be redirected to stripe where i can make a payment and subscribe okay so there we go we have our price that we have in 29 dollars a month for react seo and then we can just enter in our payment information and subscribe so that is how you integrate stripe with a lovable app pretty easy it's only a couple of minutes job really if you've got any questions let me know in the comments if you've got some value give it a like subscribe to the channel and i'll catch you in the next one